everybody and welcome to Jeopardy! I am your host, Justin, and today we got some fierce competitors who are just discovering right now that anyone who ends with a negative amount, or zero, gets one finger cut off. So why don't we dive in and look at these categories? <laughs> no. We got Asian history, baseball nicknames, road trip to the same name place, Give it to me, brother. Give us the name shared by the places each trip starts and ends. Uh, toys and games. This one I expect us to do good in. <sighs> Numbers and Oriel. Not to be confused with Oral, which is what James would probably be thinking about because it is Horny Saturday. Or, it is Horny or Saturday. Or Oreo. Yeah. Um, my favorite or person Ariel. here at the table is obviously Megan. So you get to choose the first category. Wow. Well, you know, let's oh. start it off strong with toys and games for a thousand. Or yeah, I don't know about you, but I feel great. ripped. This puzzle's game name nope. is shortening of a Japanese phrase that means the numbers are restricted to single status. Mitchell. Oh. What is Sudoku? That is correct. Oh, oh. nice. Uh, let's go numbers 200. For the U.S. Senate to conduct business, a quorum of this many senators must be present. Oh. US. Why does it gotta be U.S. stuff? Mike. It's it's a low number. Let's go. It's uh, what is uh, thirty six? That is incorrect. Uh, it's fifty something. I don't know. Fifty one. Fifty one. Mitchell, it is still your board. Numbers four hundred. Sorry, which one? Numbers. All right. At the 2009 World Athletics Championships, this distance was completed in a record 9.58 seconds. Mike. Uh, what is the 100 meter dash? That is correct. Good guess, good guess. Uh, numbers for 600. There are 76 trom Tyler! There are 76 trombones and 110 cornets mentioned in the song from this show. What is the music man? That is correct, Nathan. But next time, wait for me to say your name or I will cut off one of your fingers early. <laughs> That's fine. Please take my ring finger because I'll never get married. All right. No, it's your middle <laughs> finger, the best finger. Oh, that's fine. I can you live with that. You got a though. choice. That, no, that's, that's fair. Uh, God, I love that musical so much. Uh, let's go with uh, Toys and Games for 400. While recovering from polio in 1948, teacher Eleanor Abbott invented this sweet board game for the children in the ward to play. Nathan. Ha! What is Candyland? That is correct, because it's sweet. Do you get it? Nathan, it's your board. Do you get it? Uh, Toys and Games for 600. Mm -hmm. Richard Garfield gathered his wits to create this 1993 fantasy card game. Megan. What is Magic the Gathering? That is correct. Uh, Toys and Games for 1,000. All right, let's finally get it right for you this time. George <laughs> Lerner originally had trouble selling this toy because after World War II, it seemed wasteful to make toys using veggies. Mitchell. Oh. Mr. Potato Head? That is correct. Yes. Uh, let's finish no off 800. Mr. Potato Head. Uh, sorry, Mitchell? Uh, toys and Games, 800. Created in 1959, these dolls named for a creature of Scandinavian folklore were known for their unique hairstyles. Oh. Nathan. What are trolls? What are trolls? You're bored. <laughs> Who knows? Um, oh, that was fine. Oral for 200, please. Uh, <laughs> Oriole, once again, it's not Horny Saturday because James is not here. We are free of that. <laughs> this spring holiday was once called Decoration Day. I'm going to be mad about Memorial this Day. Everyone, oh, will, every answer will have Oriole in it. Nathan, still your right, board. Let's go Oriole for 400. This is an interesting idea. The part of a computer program that walks you through the instructions. Nathan. <sighs> what is a tutorial? That is correct. Your board. Oh. Uh, Oriole for 600. <laughs> the latitude of this African <laughs> nation is where it got its two word name. Ah. Uh... Equatorial Guinea is what we were looking for. Uh, that makes sense. That does Complete. make sense. Nathan, yeah. it's still your board. Uh, 800. <laughs> this is a fun one. I like this. A word coined in the 20th century. It's a section of a newspaper intended to look like news, but really hawking a product. Megan. Oh, I might be wrong. What is it, an editorial? That is incorrect. Yeah. Yeah. 
We were advertorial. For advertorial. Interesting. Uh, Never Nathan, heard that word. Let's get rid of this category. For four, this math function is four times three times two times one. Tyler. Oh, come on. What Tyler. is a factorial? That is correct, Tyler. It is no. your board. Oh. Numbers for 800. Found in the last book of the Bible, it was a common telephone prefix in Reeves, uh, LA, but residents got the option to change it. Oh, 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 oh. Mitchell. Uh, what is 666? Hail Satan, brother! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's finish up numbers. All right. It's the total number of dots on a standard die. Oh, fuck. Tyler. Oh. What is 21? That is correct. Wow. Black Tyler has answered two. Oh, chat, one second. We got some hails. We got some sixes. <laughs> So we got, oh, there's three here from James. Hail Satan, James. Hail Satan, James. Hail Satan, James. Fluffy Ponies. Hail Satan. Jacqueline. Hail Satan. Chain Dreamer. Hail Satan. You know what? We're going to take a quick break to talk to all of our guests. Uh, Mitchell, what is your favorite part about the Dark Lord Satan? Um, I, I think it's, 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 it's his hair. His hair is black like coal, and when you touch it, it is cool like ice. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I like uh, to Tyler, just put my hands uh, through it. You, do you have something to, that you want to share about, with us about your love of the Dark Lord here and now? <laughs> I, I think it's got to be his radiant energy. He's just glowing all he the is. time. It's all that fire and around I, him. I just want to absorb it. All right, Nathan, uh, this is your first time hailing Satan live on the show. Is there anything you want to say to him? Uh, I love you, uh, and I love... Uh, your, your, your tongue. His tongue is forked, just like his tail. It's super sick. Mike, what do you want to say to the mm. Dark Lord Satan who is watching us right now? Uh, Baba Booey, Baba Booey, Baba Booey. Baba Booey, <laughs> indeed. Otherwise, it's, uh, it's close enough to Beezlebub that we'll give that to you. It's, it's a good one there. <laughs> Uh, and finally, Megan, is there anything you want us to, you want to share with us about what you love about Satan? Uh, I would say I love that he is both squishy inside and out. Yes, he is made of flesh just like we are, but his flesh is more pure. I agree. Anyways, <laughs> let's go back. You guys are halfway through the board. You are now in the questions that you probably do not even want to fathom looking at. But Tyler, it is your board. Yeah, fuck the left side of the board. <laughs> Road trip to the same named place. You'll spend a lot of time on I-95 going from Maine to Georgia, maybe to see a major golf tournament. S the what States. is Augusta? We're looking for Augusta. Yeah, Augusta. definitely. Yeah. Knew that. that All right, Tyler, place. still your board. Same names for 400. Interstate stops in Cleveland and Cheyenne may await on a trek from Maine's largest city to Oregon's. Nathan. What is Portland? That is correct. You're bored. Uh, oh. yeah. um, a Portland in Maine. Yeah, there's a that's Portland why I was in every of them. Little, there's, there's a Portland a, there's in a all 50 states. There's a Springfield in all of them. There's a fucking Kansas in all of them. That's all there's what I'm learning. There's a Park in one of them. Um, <laughs> let's go them. baseball nicknames for 200, please. The Splendid Splinter and Teddy Ball Game. Yeah, nope. I was just curious. <laughs> Category is this? Ted baseball. Williams. These were his baseball, baseball nicknames. Oh. Nathan, it's still your board. Asian history for 200. Hey, Paul. How's it going? Hey, Paul. In the late 12th century, this Buddhist sect arrived in Japan. It would become, a po become popular with the warrior class. Paul's Nathan. birthday today. <gasps> no. Samurai? What are the samurai? No. It's yeah, Paul's no. birthday? Yeah. Happy birthday, Paul's Paul. Birthday? What's Happy it like birthday. to be the big four -oh? Happy birthday. <laughs> Zen. 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 What are you looking for? Interesting. All right. Happy uh, birthday um... to you. Happy birthday. Mr. President. To Paul. Happy birthday God, to God. you. <laughs> oh, good. I'm Happy glad that happened. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna sing happy birthday, but in a no. round of, like row the boat, okay? No. Happy birthday <laughs> to, to you. you. Happy birthday, birthday to, to you. All right. Happy uh, Nathan. birthday. Nathan, what category would you like to go to? Uh, Asian history for 400. Uh, Thailand, uh, then known by this name, entered World War I in 1917 on the side of the Allies. I feel like I should know this, but I don't. Siam. We're looking for Siam. Oh, of course. Nathan, it's still your board. Asian history. King of for Siam. Time. Yeah. Uh, a, a junta led by General Park Chung Hee took over this country, ending its Second Republic in 1961. Of course, I could have pronounced that wrong, but let's go with it. I think you. I think you nailed it. Sounded good enough for me. Bye, Paul. Mm -hmm. South, South Korea. Korea. Mm -hmm. Should we keep it going, Nathan? Sure. Why not? Around 770, the rocks cut temples seen here was completed at Alor, India, and dedicated to the main god, the Destroyer. Oh, I could do this one. Does this get to show us a picture? Yeah, but just picture it in your head. Oh, okay. I would <laughs> like to be a Destroyer. Okay. So, yeah. Finish him. Dude, let's go hard. In 2001, Kofi Annan pleaded with this country to stop the destruction of Buddhist statues, but sadly, they were demolished. Oh, dude, that's fucking sad. 2001, that's recent. I mean, it's not, Afghanistan. but... Oh, makes sense. Makes mm. sense. Do you guys, like, think, like, 2001, you're like, oh, that was 10 years ago. Like... Yeah. Like, anything in the office, I'm like, oh, ago. that was 10 years ago. <laughs> yeah. Anything in my lifetime is recent. Like... <laughs> that's, like, one of those things where I realized that, like, we are... The year we were born was closer to the moon landing than the time oh. we've spent on this Earth. No. What? No. Mm. No. <laughs> Wait, whoa. Uh huh? Wait, it, what do you mean it's closer than the time we've spent on this Earth? So I don't even understand how that's going to be. So years, and the moon landing was only 20 years before we were born. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, road trip to same name place for. Okay, 600, I guess. Interstate stops in Cleveland and. Sh Sorry, what was that? Didn't we do oh, that, that one? No, we didn't. Nope. All right, well, no. congratulations, uh, no, you can do it. Megan. You, can you do got it right. again. You're bored. <laughs> <laughs> what was the answer? Sorry, Mike. <laughs> Salem. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, I have to choose now. Uh, let's uh, do yeah, you... the same name for 800. <laughs> You'll head south on I-65, and remember I said south when you go from Miami University to the University of Mississippi. Uh, hmm. What? South? south? Something. From Miami? Yeah, but Something remember, south. I said south. Oxford. Oxford. Mm. Let's Wait, do a thousand. Get south. rid of it. Daily double, Megan. Now, remember, I, I gave you $600, so you need to wager at least $600. Uh, I believe you only... Oh, yeah, you would have had to because I had minus 200. Just okay. Show, 19 months of the golden table. It's going good with us. How's it going with you? All right, is your wager in? Not quite. One sec. It's hard when you're not facing your board. There you go. 600 just for you, Justin. All right. You start uh, on Interstate 91 out of one in Massachusetts, but you end up on Interstate 55 to reach the one in Illinois. Uh, this is really funny. Uh, <laughs> Guess something, Megan. I uh, don't have a guess. I it don't. It was Springfield. The thing Mike was said was, was everywhere. Oh my God. Like Springfield. There was one in every freaking state. That's so funny. I should have just guessed. All right, Megan, uh, you're bored. 400 n nicknames, please. Let's do it. The big fucking unit. <laughs> uh, Nathan. Uh, who is James? Oh, I wish. <laughs> Mike. Uh, who is Mitchell? That is incorrect. Ah. Dang. You guys know this is not PBG Jeopardy, right? Mitchell, you're up. Uh, who is Justin? No, that is also incorrect. <laughs> <laughs> ha. We were looking for Randy Johnson. Ooh, ah. Randy Johnson. Megan, should I keep, keep it going? Keep it going. That's <laughs> Mr. Cub to you. Man, okay. I wish I knew a single thing about baseball. <laughs> Me too. Uh, 800, Banks. Ernie please. Banks. That's Mr. October to you. 
Uh, the Calendar Girls. Uh, oh, <laughs> uh, Reggie, Reggie Jackson, Jackson. Jackson. finally oh, got out of that his true circle of yeah. hell. That's Mr. Mr. November. November to you. <laughs> Who are the Calendar Girls? Mike. This one's got to be James. That is incorrect. <laughs> he just lost a thousand dollars. No, James is Mr. September because that's the month he wants to be for the calendar. Uh, that's true. It, it is the month. All right, show double jeopardy. Let's see what our categories are this time. Opera songs, oh, 17th century <laughs> lit, me medium abbreviations, I assume. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Around the world, large and in charge. This category is entirely about James <laughs> and colorful <laughs> language. These will also be about racist James. Racist slurs. So yeah. <laughs> I have to end the show here. <laughs> Mike, due to your uh, $1,000 loss in the first round, you yeah. get to start us off. Uh, let's do let's do colorful language for, for Ooh, 400. Dang, we're learning a lot about Mike here, aren't we? <laughs> I'm sick of all the bureaucratic nonsense. Let's cut this stuff once used to bind legal documents. Nathan. What is red tape? That is correct. Wow. It has um, colors in the words. Yeah. Uh, around the world for 400. As reaffirmed by a 2011 referendum, Italy is the only G7 country that produces no electricity through this method. Mike. Uh, what is coal? That is incorrect. Oh. Nathan. It's the wind? That is incorrect. Hmm. Mitchell. What is nuclear? That is correct. You're bored. Ah! Oh. Oh. Let's go with large and tiny. in charge, 400. This Marvel character was modeled on Frankenstein's monster crossed with Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Oh. Nathan. Uh. Who is the Incredible Hulk? That is correct. Also, Nathan, just for reference, um, because you weren't there for future games, I saw you clicking. We have a rule that you have to wait till the lights go up to even start clicking, just for future okay, reference. Right. Okay. Yeah, there's a little uh, at the side of the playing board. Oh, yeah, that's what those are. Interesting. Yeah. But yeah, I, I knew that was, it's all good. You weren't here for the time I yelled at James because he had a fucking shortcut auto key clicker on his mouse. <laughs> yeah. yeah, he had like an auto clicker. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He had a spam clicker on his mouse. Yeah, yeah. he was wiping the board like he, he, no one could out click him. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Nathan, it's your board. Uh, oh, this might be med medical abbreviations. This might yeah. be medical oh, abbreviations. Oh. Mm, I literally I thought you were one. joking when you said medium. I knew it was medical the whole time. Oh. Uh, let's go larger than charge 800, because I don't want to do that, because it's not medium abbreviations. Uh, Boba Fett froze Han Solo in Carbonite and brought him to this crime lord, who called his prize, who called the prize his Nunchene Wadawanga. Mitchell. Dude, fuck. Who is Jabba the Hutt? That is correct. Let's do uh, large in charge, 1200. Uh, half your oh. Jorninson played Gregor Cl uh, Clegane, aka the Mountain, on this show. Mitchell. Oh. What is Game of Thrones? That is correct. You're bored. Oh. Uh, let's keep it going. This giant female Lepito uh, Lepidopteran has been terrorizing Japan in monsters movies since 1961. Mitchell. Uh. What is Godzilla? That is incorrect. <gasps> Nathan. Who is Mothra? That is correct. Uh, large and in charge for 2,000. I like this category. Mm -hmm. Yeah, me too. It's really Made fun. by the Muffin Man, Mongo is the name of a huge one of these that attacks the castle at the end of Shrock... Shrock... <laughs> <laughs> Shrock... Of Shrock 2. Mike. Uh, what is the Gingerbread Man? That is correct. Shrock. <laughs> Shrock. <laughs> uh, Mike, you're up. My favorite movie, Shrock 2. Uh... <laughs> Uh, medical abbreviations for 400. Yeah. Injuries are sometimes treated with PT, short for this. Nathan. What is physical therapy? That is correct. You're bored. Fuck it. Medical abbreviations for 800. <laughs> In the UK, patients are often treated by a GP, short for this. Mitchell. Uh, what is a general practitioner? That is correct. You're bored. Uh, let's do medical abbreviations 1200. RA is this joint disease. Nathan. Rheumatoid. What is rheumatoid arthritis? Good save. You're bored. Uh, medical abbreviations for 1600. 
According to the initials, COPD is this type of pulmonary disease. Ooh. Cardiac of the poop disorder. Do you want to know oh. something funny? So my last name, Ca uh, uh, Caudi, is now, um, it's a medical abbreviation for, um, what is it? <laughs> catheter, like catheter-assisted catheter urinary tract infection. <laughs> nice. Isn't that fucking Congrats. great? <laughs> it's awesome. Rough. Congratulations. It's an honor yeah. to have you with us tonight. Yeah. Uh, Nathan, you're up. Uh, let's finish this category. During this surgery, TKR, the ends of the femur and tibia are removed and then capped with metal pl with metal and plastic pieces. Uh, what? That would be a total knee replacement. Not just one oh, knee, a oh. total knee replacement. Nathan, where are we going next? Uh, let's see how lit the 17th century is. Thomas Elwood said he got this poet to write a late epic by asking him, what about Paradise Found? Megan. Oh, um, fuck. Nope, don't got it, don't All got right. it. Nathan. Uh, who is John Milton? That is correct, you're bored. Oh, wow. Paradise Lost Baby. Yeah. Uh, 17th century lit for 800. It's hella lit. Ben Johnson wrote popular comedies like the 1610 play about one of these magical gold changers. Hmm. Hmm. The Alchemist. Just The Alchemist. Oh, all right. Nathan, you're bored. That's uh, let's do uh, Colorful Language for 800. A 1907 paper compared the warming influence of Earth's atmosphere to the effect of one of these structures. Nathan. A uh, greenhouse? What is a greenhouse? Fuck me. It's fine. I'll give it to you because... Oh, okay. I don't know why. Because everybody guess gets one? Good mood. Because everybody gets one? You know what? I'm taking it away from you, actually. I'm changing my mind. <laughs> oh. Oh. But yeah. everybody gets one. Uh, no, my you story. You took two I'm, away I, from I, me. I, uh, the answer's already... Oh. The time is coming gone. I do appreciate your, uh, your uh, oomph, though. Uh, <laughs> Justin, I was at 6,800. Uh, I was at 6,000 and then 6,800, and now I'm at 5,200. Yeah, because you lost 800 was... for that one. Uh, Mike, I'm no, going to give you the 6, answer 800. and then take it away from you, okay? I was at, was... at 6,800. Yeah, so you got it wrong. You, you, you lose money for no, getting no, it wrong. No. Yeah, no, hey, Nathan, yes, you're no. at, six, Let me finish you're what at I'm 6, saying. 6,000. I gave you 6,800, and then I took it away, so that's why you're down oh, to 5,200. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. Yep. All right. Cool. Uh, Mike, it is now your board because of how everything works on PPG Jeopardy. <laughs> <laughs> Call for language or 1,200. Spherical word meaning to vote against a candidate or to ostracize someone socially. Mike. What is a blackout? That is incorrect. Mm. It's painful how close you were, though. It's a black, black ball. ball. You forgot oh, about the spear black, in the clue. It's still your board, Mike. Interesting. Okay. Uh, 1600. FIFA rules say a soccer player who's shown one of these is getting cautioned, not ejected. Mike. What is the yellow card? That is correct. I almost gave Mitch a yellow Tell card, and he said lamb and sheep were different answers. <laughs> <laughs> 2,000 for colorful language. Colorful language for 2,000. Daily double. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. No, oh, baby. Dude, do 2,000. I can't do that. Do 2,000. I can do 2,000, can I? You can, Let's yeah. go. All right, Let's Mike, go. good luck. The final draft in an authoritative government report is one of these for the stuff it's printed on and its color. <laughs> that laugh. What it's printed on? Something paper. The white papers? That is correct. Yes. Oh, oh babe! <laughs> it was just white paper. So funny. <laughs> well, I was thinking because white paper is like code. Like when you code something, or, or like there's yeah. usually a white paper on it. Mm -hmm. So I was like, is it just that? I went with it. Well, Mike, I'm happy for you. Where are we going next? Let's go around the world for 800. That's a very uh, cheap Embedded trip with the stones world. that glow in the dark, the Van Gogh path in the Nether Netherlands was inspired by this painting. Tyler. What is Starry Night? Correct. You're bored. Uh, around nice. the world for 1200. What became this South African city started in 1652 as a Dutch East India Company refreshment station. Megan. 
What is Johannesburg? That is incorrect. Hmm. You can tell she was disappointed on that one. Cape Town. Cape Town. Tyler, it is still your board. Uh, around the world for 16. After the Canbelay riots of the 1880s, the British banned traditional drums on Trinidad, leading to the creation of these from oil drums. Tyler. What are steel pan or steel drums? That is correct. You're bored. Nice. Uh, yeah. Around the world for 2000. When artist Edi Rama became mayor of this Albanian capital, he had many of the drab buildings repainted in bright colors. Albanian. Albanian capital. Let's capital. call Elvin up on the phone. Tirana is what we're looking for. Tirana. Tyler, it is still you. What do you want to go to next? Uh, opera for 400. Habanera is the popular name for an aria from this opera about a gypsy woman. Uh, I, I know like two operas. Where in the world is oh, Carmen San Diego? And that's one of the operas I know, but I didn't know that. Yeah. Uh, opera for eight. Vesti Lagiba, put on the costume, is from this clownish work. But Doctor, I'm Pegliacci, is what we were looking for. <laughs> uh, let's keep going in opera. Daily Double. Yeah. Go for it, 2000. I think this category is much harder to get 2000 on, because Mike's was just a color and a word. Let's yeah. go with 2000. <laughs> <laughs> Sung first by Clara, not by either title character. Summertime in the Living is easy in this 20th century opera. I know the song. I think no. What is West Side Story? That is incorrect. I figured as much. All right, what do you got next? What was it? What was the correct answer? Porgy and Bess. Oh, okay. Uh, um, opera, 16. Oh, Porgy. Uh, Liebes Tod is from this Wagner opera about a pair of doomed lovers. They're all doomed. Every one of them. They're all, it's yeah, opera. every one of them is doomed. Tristan and a, a soldier. Uh, yeah. Get rid of opera. <laughs> this chorus hammers down the Verdi opera Il Trovatore. Uh. The Anvil Chorus. Mm. Oh, where to mm. next, Hammers Tyler? down, boo. Uh, 1,200. Kira Knightley made her West End debut in a modern version of this Frenchman's The Misanthrope. Interesting. Don't know. Might know. Moliere. No. Moliere. I don't know. 16. An early English novel is... Uranoko, or the royal this about an African prince sold to a Suriname plantation. Slave. Damn it! It's just that easy. <laughs> All right, last question. Published in 1697, this Frenchman's collection of fairy tales includes Sleeping Beauty and Puss in Boots. Give me that puss in the boots. Dude, why did this guy have to call it fucking Puss and Boots? Yeah. Uh, Charles Perrault. Let's see what the category Sorry. is. Wait. It is early U.S. Oh. history. Oh. Let's oh. go and get your dabs on, everybody, because we're going we're gonna to get five correct answers here. Oh, I tried to wager a negative number. Could do it. Could do it. <laughs> All right, final zero. questions. Wouldn't Elvis have you a Gary, Charles Pick, uh, Panickney, and John Marshall were the diplomats in this 1797 incident that led to a quasi-war with France. Oh. Now a word from our sponsors. Were you... Did you not get enough Schrock and Schrock 2? Well, wait for <laughs> Schrock the third coming to theaters <gasps> next week. Oh, it disappeared when I clicked enter. What happened? Dude, everyone is in the positives except Megan this week. Good job, it's everybody. True. I'm going to be so oh my god. This is going to be my game. Right. No, that can't be correct. All right. No, wrong, John. Oh, I guess I should play the Jeopardy music. I haven't done that yet. So. <clears throat> Jeez. I was too busy talking about Shrock the Third. Shrock the Third. Great movie.
Can you hit enter or anything? No, it just takes whatever's on your board. Okay, cool. All right. We got Banana Rebellion, which is... So, let's start with Mitchell. Mitch got the French Fry Massacre. That is unfortunately wrong, but he bet zero dollars. Uh, <coughs> Tyler said the What is the Boston Tea Party, which is also unfortunately wrong, and he also bet zero dollars. Nathan wrote Banana Rebellion, which is also incorrect, and he bet two hundred dollars. Mike wrote <clears throat> What is the Statue of Liberty fiasco, and he bagered a hundred dollars. And Megan doesn't get a play, but she said What is this? <laughs> it's magic huh? everywhere. It's magic in the air. So, looking at our scores, Megan was, what was the answer. What was the answer? Megan what was the answer? answer? Oh, do you guys really care? No. <laughs> it Don't was the tell XYZ us. affair. Fuck, I thought it was John Adam, not John Marshall. God damn it. The XYZ uh, affair. Yeah. So, uh, now to go into the scores, Megan had negative 1800. Uh, mm -hmm. Mike had 2,700, Mitch was in third place with 3,200, Tyler 4,200, and Nathan wins this week with $5,000. I did oh. it. I'd like well, to thank the Academy for believing in me. No, you only can um, thank one person here, and that is Satan. I would like to thank Satan for believing in me So with his Me tongue. Uh, Megan, I guess you can send me a text later about which finger you're going to lose. Does that sound fair? Yeah, I'll let you know. I'll let you know. Cool. We'll see you guys next it. week for more uh, more Jeopardy.